Do you think it's going to take long? No, he should be finished soon. No way. Yo, what the hell? <laughs> Man's looking at him like, what the fuck? Charlene, I'll look at the reports later. I'll cancel all appointments for this afternoon. Okay. Oh, Captain. Agent Norman Jaden from the FBI is here. Jaden, of course. We've been expecting you. I'm in a bit of a hurry. Do you mind tagging along? We can talk as we walk. Yeah, of course. I wanted to introduce myself before getting started, but uh, perhaps there's a better no, time. No, no. it's fine. I just have to get to the press conference. We have them every day now. Believe me, it's not always easy finding something to tell them. Fortunately, today we have some news. Have you met Lieutenant Blake yet? Yeah, we met this morning. He has his own methods, but he's a good cop. I'm sure you'll get him well together. Do you know how to tie a knot in a necktie? I guess. To be frank with you, I could have done without the FBI on this one, but the press they're all over us. This origami killer case crept up on us, and it's fast becoming a national concern. There are hundreds of killers in this country, but what do you know? This guy is exotic. He leaves flowers and origami figures. Work that one out. What the That's fuck? Him, and we suddenly become the center of the universe. Did I not just I'm do it? To arrest a serial killer. With all due respect, sir, the rest of it, it's none of my business. No. Oh. Of course. There we go. All I'm asking is that you make progress and fast. The press want a perpetrator, and we're gonna have to serve him up on a silver platter. Hmm. Not bad. Oh, go see Charlene. She'll show you to your office. Uh, check in on the press conference if you're interested. It'll give you an idea of the political climate around here. Thank you, sir. Welcome to the club, Jaden. Okay. Where's my officer? Oh, she's right there. Nice watch. Oh, it's the present we offer to our new lieutenants. We bought the same model each year for the past 20 years for each promotion. It optimizes everybody's time, and it's the kind of thing that always goes down well. You can contribute to our fund if you like. We're still a few dollars short. Nah, fuck that. Sorry, I... I don't have any chance. No problem. 
Maybe next time round. Captain Perry said you could show me to my office? Yes, of course. Follow me. All right. This dirty ass office, bro. What the hell? This This is my office? That's where I was told to take you. If you need anything, you know where to find me. That's crazy. Now nah, they done him dirty. Okay, time to work. Okay. Step one, change the office. Okay. What's this? Now, nah, what the fuck? But this is like the, the Vision Pro, the Apple Vision Pro. But it's like way, way more immersive. This is what the Apple Vision Pro wish they were. What's this? No way. It's gonna be like some autumn vibe. I like this. What the fuck? Mars? Oh hell nah. I'ma stick with this. I like this one. This is the one, this is the one. Uh now what? Clues. The killer's car is probably a Chevrolet Malibu eighty three. data no prints or specific clues hmm nothing much to go on just one origami store in town mm. okay Common species. That doesn't help much. The orchid is a common species. It can be found at any flower shop. Yeah. Okay. Files.
eight victims in the last three years. All boys, aged between nine and thirteen. That's crazy. No signs of violence. The victims disappear from public places in broad daylight. And no last three years. Anything. So since that was before. Uh, three to five days later. Drowned. In rainwater. They all died the same way. So this killer was like here before where the bodies are found. Jason was like even died. All the victims disappeared <coughs> in the fall. Yeah, it was before what happened to Jason. The killer has a large comfort zone. He gained confidence rapidly and moved away from his base. Hmm, this won't make the geo profiling any easier. Always the same ritual. An origami in the hand, an orchid on the chest. The victims have always been dead for less than six hours when they were found, which means they remained alive for several days before being drowned. Over 3,500 people questioned, over 100 suspects interrogated. Not a single lead to go on. Crazy. The killer is white, aged between 30 and 45. He is intelligent, calm, and determined. An organized type. He has a car. He's probably employed, but his work allows him free time. Wait, did we not see this already? We did. Okay, so that's everything. I think that's it. Oh, shit. What's happening to him? Here we go again. I better go wash my face. What the hell's going on? I need to take some. I'm gonna faint if I Oh resist. shit. What's going on? These Sorry. guys all have like diseases, bro. Like what's I wrong with They all have problems. They're all fucked up. Nah, not yet, not yet. Just go. Where's the bathroom? Where's the bathroom? Oh. No one. No one will see. Let's go. What the fuck? He's twitching and shit. Fuck wrong with him. Go, go, go. Quick. Wash your face.
This is Lieutenant Blake, Mr. Marsh. Could you please tell him what happened? It, it was this afternoon. I went to the park with my son, Sean. We played together for a while, and then he wanted to go on the carousel, so I put him on one of the wooden horses, and when I turned back, Sean had disappeared. Exactly what time did you arrive at the park? Try to remember exactly, Mr. Mars. Every detail can be important. It must have been about... It was 4.15. It was 4.15. 4.15. Yeah, that's it. 4.15. I remember exactly because I looked at the clock in the park when we arrived. What was your son wearing when he disappeared? He was wearing a coat. A uh, beige, beige, beige. A beige, beige. coat. And a pair of pants. I think black, right? Black pants or brown? Or is it brown? It might brown have been pants. Black. Oh, shit. How could Sean have disappeared without you even noticing? Weren't you right by the carousel? Little walk stayed... Uh... I went for a short walk around the park just for a few minutes. When I got back, the carousel had stopped and Sean wasn't there. Can't tell them exactly what happened, then, because then they'll suss us out. But you didn't report him missing until 8.15. Why did it take you so long to contact the police? Uh, I waited. I Okay, I waited. I went home and waited for him there. I thought he might have gone out with some friends and they would come home soon. Did Sean have oh any particular difficulties, Mr. Mars? Anything that might have caused him to run away? Uh, no. Uh, no. No, I don't think so. Everything okay at school? Any particular problems between you and your wife? The fuck? No. No, nothing in particular. It's always, they always ask the personal ask questions. All right, that's all the questions I have for now. You're free to go, Mr. Mars. We'll continue to look for Sean overnight. We'll contact you if we have any more questions. Do, do you think the origami killer? Listen. Your son's probably just run off and he'll turn up in a couple hours. But what if it is the yeah. origami killer? Well, then we have about four days to find him alive. Oh, shit. Did they find something? No, nothing yet, but they're going to keep looking through the night. Do they... do they think it's the origami killer? Oh, shit. It, it, it's still too early to say. But it is a possibility. What happened, Ethan? How could you lose Sean like that? You should never have taken your eyes off him. I mean, for God's sake, how hard is it to keep your eye on a child in the park? Why did you leave him, Ethan? Why? She's gonna Wasn't blame it enough everything losing wrong. Jason? Yeah, I knew it. I knew she was gonna say that. I'm sorry. That's not what I meant to say. He was definitely their favorite child, innit? Jason was definitely their favorite. And it was on his birthday as well. Sir. 
Can I help you, sir? Well, I hope so. My name's Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. Uh, I'm investigating the case of the origami killer. I I'd like to ask you a few questions. My son is dead, Mr. Shelby. I have nothing more to say. Uh, I also lost someone I loved. I know what you're feeling. Then you will understand that I do not wish to talk about it. The killer has kidnapped another victim. A ten-year-old boy. Like your son, Risa. I have four days before we find his body on a deserted stretch of wasteland. No one did anything to save my son. Now, you would please to move along, sir. Oh, do you sell inhalers? I'm all out, and at least I won't go away completely empty-handed. In the back of the store, to the right. Thanks. Okay. What the hell? Oh, shit. Evening, Are you looking for something in particular? Give me what you got in the register. Don't fucking try anything. Oh, shit. Open the register, you dumb fuck. Put the money on the counter. Yo. Shit, are you deaf or what? Are you gonna open that fucking register or not? No, sir. You do not have the right to steal that money from me. I have worked very hard to earn it. You cannot have it. What did you say? You're out of your fucking mind, man. You don't get it, do you? I'm gonna put a fucking bullet right between your eyes if you don't do what I <gasps> say now. Oh. You're my register, sir. That money is mine. I ask you now to leave before it is too late. Christ, goddamn idiot! Go! Register. Don't make me fucking kill you. Don't turn around. No, sir. That I cannot do. Quick! I waste you, man. I ain't fuck. Drop it now. Don't move. Hands up. Put your fucking hands up, or I'll shoot. What the fuck? Don't panic. Let's just stay calm. Nobody here wants to hurt you. Uh, we're all just gonna be cool, and everything will be all right. Yeah, yeah. I'm cool, man. Everything's gonna be all fucking right. The fuck? Look, it's not worth it. Put the gun down. And just walk away. You giving me advice? I'll give you some fucking advice. You don't really want to shoot anybody, do you? I'm sure we can find a way out of this mess, right? Uh, my name's Scott. What about you? What's your name? Andrew. My name's Andrew. Do you have anyone you care for in your life? A, a girlfriend, maybe? A family? Yeah. A little girl. I got a little girl. Her name's Jessica. What okay. would Jessica think if she saw you here? Ask yourself, what would happen to her if things go wrong? You haven't done anything serious yet. If you put the gun away, we'll forget about what just happened, and that will be the end. Just walk away. Nothing serious. Shit, man! What the fuck do you think I'm doing here? Relax. Breathe. Nice try. For a second there, you almost had me believing all your shit. Oh my god. And now, give me the money. I'm gonna count to three. One. Two. Oh shit. Oh shit. Nice. Good shit, bro. Get the fucking gun off him. 
Nice. Thousand thank you, sir. I don't know what would have happened if you had not been well, here. This I didn't come by for nothing. Have a nice day. When my boy, Razor, disappeared, I received a letter with a locker ticket inside. Inside the locker, I found this box. What the I hell? do not understand what it means, but I think it must be a sort of message from the man who took my son from me. Can I? The hell is that? Ah, oh, it's another origami piece. If it can be of any use to you at all, it did not help me to save Reza, but maybe it will help you find the other little boy. Mr. Shelby, I was beginning to think that there was no good to be found in this place. I can see now that I was wrong. Okay, new character, maybe? Big ass apartment. <gasps> Shit. Whoa, 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 what the fuck? What's going on? Yo. There's someone in the house. There's someone in the apartment. Who is this? Who who's She must be someone important, isn't it? Cuz some some rich person or some shit. Journalist maybe. Yeah, she looks like a journalist. Put some clothes on. Yeah, she's definitely a journalist. <gasps> Yo, nah, 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 there's someone in here, there's someone in here, there's someone in here. Wait, 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 wait. There's someone in the yard, there's someone in the yard. Go get a bat or some shit. There's someone in the yard, there's someone in the yard. 
Wait, 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 wait. There's definitely someone in the house, bro. What the hell? Scale, find a weapon or some shit. What the hell? Even the bathroom is massive. Nah, this is kind of creepy. Nah, 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 the, bro. There's a thief, there's a thief. There's therefore a thief in here. 100, 100. Bro, you gonna put some... Fuck. What happened? God, fridge is open. Yo, <sighs> the fuck? there's no way there's someone here. There's someone in the apartment. The phone on the desk. I could call for help. The front door. It's the only way out. If I can reach it, I still have a chance. Go, 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 go. Quick. Where the fuck is it? Fuck, who is this? Motherfucker. Oh, what's going on? Oh, there's multiple! What the fuck? Nice. Run. Oh my god, there's more. Bruh. 
Nice. Good shit. Run. What the fuck? <gasps> nah, 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 nah. This bitch is sick in the head. Who? Nah, 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 nah. Who has a dream like that? Like, actually, though. Who the fuck dreams like this? Yeah, she's sick in the head. She's sick in the head. Only sickos have dreams like that, bro. What the fuck? I actually thought she was dead. The fuck? These are all journalists, reporters and shit. When the parents came home from church, all their children were gone. They searched and called for them, they cried and begged, but it was all to no avail. The children have never been seen again. We've seen this already. have to get out of here and find out what does it mean some sort of fairy tale that letter might be linked to Sean's disappearance I need to show it to the police yeah. I'm the origami killer I black out and then the murdering starts I huh? know it's me. what this doesn't make any sense it couldn't have been me I couldn't ever have done that Nah, nah, yo, if there's some, like, fucking twisted ass, like, plot twist in this shit, there probably is. I don't remember, like, I don't remember the story, but... Nah, bro, nah, there's no way, there's no way. There's no way. There's gonna be some crazy plot twist. There's gonna be some crazy plot twist. Mr. Mars, Mr. Mars, a few Mars. words. Mr. Mars. Goddamn reporters. <laughs> They've been camped outside my house all day. Nah, they're fucking annoying, bro. They actually, that, that shit would be annoying as hell. Uh, What if I go out through the back? What if I leave through the back? They won't know. Could just leave this way, right? Yeah, see, there is a way through the back. Nice. I knew it. I should have worn a hood or some shit. They'll put. They might still see me. Quick, quick, quick. Go. Nice.
What's the locker number? He's gonna black out again. Oh, he's getting flashbacks. What happened to Jason? Gonna, gonna have to make it through the crowd. I can't, can't take crowds. Just can't handle it. Yo, he's really fucked up, man. That shit really fucked him up. I can't make it. Too many people. Too many people. Come on! Yo, this guy's got some serious issues happening, bro. This guy's got some crazy shit going on. What the fuck? Huh? Oh yeah, he's the killer. Nah, this nigga's the killer, bro. What the fuck is this? Look for the look for the Dad. What the fuck? Jason <laughs> Bro what the fuck? Nah 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 Oh wait there he is there he is Jason Motherfucker stop Dad. moving Yo, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> Bro, this guy, I don't know what's going on with him, man. Like, I, I know he's got like, um, Trauma and shit, innit? it? But what the fuck? That's some weird shit. That's some like World War Two like PTSD or some shit. Fuck. Line eighteen, box number three. Line 18, box number 3. Okay. Oh, no. What are you doing? Go back! Line 18. Line 18, line 18. Line 18. Line 18. So it's this way. Has to be. If this is line 18, then... Yeah, here we go. Box number three. Nice. Open that bitch up.
Alright, we're in a hotel or motel. Open it up. What the fuck? Yo! What the hell? Alright, we got a piece. We got some origamis. And a phone. They have numbers on them. The fuck? Is it loaded? Okay, it's not loaded. Alright, cool. Are you prepared to show courage to save your son? Joe's garage and parking lot on his uh, address. Yo. Okay, so the killer's actually. Uh, this is definitely the killer's uh, doing. He's playing a fucking game with us. Fucking weirdo. What's that SD card? Play video. Oh Dad. my God! It's Sean. Sean. Nah, 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 nah. So this motherfucker is crazy. Dad. Dad. Yo, this nigga is crazy. This nigga is crazy. There's no way. Yo. Five origami figures. Each figure is a trial. Each trial provides letters. The letters reveal an address. Yo, what the fuck? This motherfucker's playing games. Okay, okay. Five origami figures. Each figure is a trial. Each trial provides letters. The letters reveal an address. Okay, okay. Okay. Thanks. 